Hi guys, this is our VW Golf. It's a 2001 petrol model which we have the engine warning light showing on the dashboard here. Um, to diagnose this and find out what the problem is, we're going to use the iCarsoft i908 multi-system scan tool uh, which will give us the fault codes we need in order to uh, remove the engine warning light. So, uh, first of all we'll click on diagnose. It's a VW vehicle and we're going to click on control modules because we know which module the fault lies it's in the engine module because we have the engine warning light on so as you can see number one there is engine electronics so we're just going to click OK to that and it's going to communicate with the engine module and it will throw back some fault codes for us to have a look at This kit is available just by clicking the link directly below this video and it covers a wide range of modules including the main ones, the engine, ABS, airbags, transmission and lots more. Uh, so first of all we've got uh, read fault code, that's what we want to do here. And there we go, it's giving us codes 1 of 2, so that's uh, 16688 or P0304, cylinder 4 missing fire detected, so that sounds like it could be um, an ignition coil but it's the DTC status is sporadic so it's uh, in other words it's intermittent and then oh, hang on. the other fault code is 16804 or P0420 catalyst system bank one efficiency below threshold uh, so that sounds like it's going to be an O2 sensor um, so we'll have to get that checked out once we've uh, located the uh, the fault and uh, replaced the uh, the correct part in this case probably an O2 sensor I suspect we might get away without changing the ignition coil uh, it's just a case of clearing fault and then that will of course erase the engine warning light as well in this VW Golf but it does work on Audi, Seat and Skoda vehicles as well um, and the main systems airbag engine, ABS, transmission um, and many more systems as well so if you are interested in this kit, just click the link directly below this video and it will take you to the page on our website. Thanks so much for watching. Okay guys, so uh, we're back in the vehicle now. We've changed over the O2 sensor and what we're going to do is we're going to try and raise the trouble code which should hopefully see us uh, the, we'll see the engine warning light disappearing from the dashboard there. Right, so we're just going to go in the same way as we went in earlier. Control, modules, engine electronics. Keep one eye on the screen here and one eye on the engine warning light. That's basically the best advice I can give you right now. Clear fault code. And there we go. Engine warning light has gone. Clear fault code succeed. So that is excellent news. That has worked. So that's the iCarsoft i908. As I say earlier, uh, it is available just by clicking the link directly below this video. Thanks for watching.